guys! Welcome back to our channel. By the way, it's me again, Phoebe. For those who are new to our channel, I'm Phoebe. And my husband BJ isn't here right now because he's busy doing something downstairs. And you know the drill already. If it's only me, I do most of the shopping haul vlog. I'm way too excited to show you the items that I have. But also, um, I can't promise you guys if I can indicate the I, the prices here. I realize from time to time it changes the rate of the peso or the money so the conversion of money so I'm not gonna um, maybe I won't indicate the prices and the conversion of it anymore but I'll just tell you if I can remember or if I can recall the price of the items okay so let's start um, Let's start with the Emco Beauty. We went to Woolies and some of the Emco Beauty are on sale. And I saw some on TikTok. Some creators on TikTok that they tried the Emco Beauty. And I wanted to try it myself. So I bought some. Since I am actually obsessed with lip balms and lip gloss. And my lips are really dry. So usually what I use is the glossy ones. Or... What do you call that one? Yeah, lip balms, lip oils, and something. So, I bought lip gloss trio, which you can just hang it somewhere. And they got like three shades, but they haven't indicated anything here. They just put um, high shine, finish, softens, and hydrates, beauty on the go, and non sticky formula. So, I bought this one. These are the colors. I don't know if you can see clearly there and I think that was about eight dollars or seven dollars and I bought this pout glass it looks like an lip oil but it's an ultra shine lip gloss so there I don't remember the price but that's probably um, around ten maybe this one, I remember that it's around $19. My husband was complaining. This one is actually the highlight glow. Highlight and glow. So I saw one creator who used this one. And it looks kind of like a dupe of another beauty brand. So I wanted to try it since it's quite cheaper than the other beauty brand. And this one as well, the cheek and lip tint, lip stain. It has, it's, it, they call it lip stain. So, lip tint. It's the same as what I bought in, I think the brand was Maybelline. I'll show it to you later, guys. So, I bought this one as well. And I think this is around $8 or 10 maybe. I'm not sure. Again, I don't have the receipt here. And I saw also this one on TikTok. It's a beauty on the go as well. So, it's from Emco Beauty. Um, yes, this one. And it's a liquid buds. So, where it's like, it has a makeup remover. And on the end, you can also touch up on the go. So, you can put... It's like a lip stain or a lipstick. So it's... I want to try it. So it's kind of like handy as well to bring. And I think this is around $7 or so. And I'm also obsessed with... um, What do you call that one? Sunscreen. So I'm super obsessed with sunscreen, lip balms, lip oils. Since... Look, it's winter and I'm having breakouts. And this one is from Aveen. There. And it's SPF 50. I tried the... They have a sample there. So I just had to try it here. It's really lightweight. So I cannot wait to use this on my face. And I think this is around... I think it's lesser than the La Rouge to say that I have so I wanted to try one of these from Aveen and 
<laughs> this one. Oh my god. Instead of perfume, I bought Vicks. It's kind of just easy because you just rub it. So you just... You take up. <laughs> like you take off the cap and then there. Um, it goes out there and then you just rub it. Since it's winter, it's cold. And, you know... I feel like I'm, I'm already old. <laughs> and I also bought this one, a lift, lifter gloss. And see, I saw another gloss again. It was on sale as well, so I bought it. And I love the shade of it as well. It's in Petal. Petal. 005. And I bought another moisturizer, which is a day cream before I put on my sunscreen so I bought it at Nivea this is how this is how it looks like this how this is how big it is so there it's a day cream and I think this is six dollars it was on sale as well so I just buy sale stuff guys and this one i bought this is what i actually um was referring to it's a uh, maybelline chic heat i got two another two shades of this but i ran out already so i bought new ones as well so i just wanted to try the emco beauty on how pigmented is it or how actually it works if it works well on the skin so I got the Maybelline one and I got the Emco Beauty one. And this one was on sale as well. But I don't remember how much. I lost the receipts. And we went to a Chinese shop. In another shop. Where they call Lancaster. They have some stuff there. That you can buy. But fruits and other cheche burache. So I bought this because I needed cups measuring cups because I love baking so I bought this one I think this was around three dollars so next one is actually a carving tool from the Chinese shop that we went to it's um it's actually three dollar fifty so we went to Kmart I needed to um buy another stock of cotton pads which was less than five dollars um this one as well cotton tips and which was also less than five dollars and next one is also this one i love their um wet wipes or facial wipes they're actually five dollars but if you buy like one of it it's around less than three dollars and it's actually gentle on the skin we went to Woolies as well i needed to buy pads this is almost the same as modest in the philippines but it's just stay free pads and i already have this one the container of it i just wanted to buy the refill so I just want to reuse my container so instead of buying another one of these I just bought the refill so this is around $15 and it's in 1.5 liter and next one is this one so my husband bought this um, I needed a turn cake turntable because I don't have any and so that it will be easy for me to actually put some of like when you design or you put the fondant or the icing it's kind of like easy for you to design a cake and this is at $17 I think my husband also bought me this one it's a bacon number pan cake pan but you can also put initials or like letters it has here so I think this is also less than less than $15 I think for less than $20 which is really nice and last we went to um, Ronnie's shop so I bought some clays polymer clay 
about different colors but there are actually two dollar 95 each i wanted to practice on um molding different types of you know um designs like how you do it in a fondant but i want to practice on a clay first before i do the fondant i i bought i bought this one there also um it's actually a modeling tool when you use clays any type of clay so there so it has different usage here and you know i like it it's very nice and it's quite cheap um i think this is at ten dollars so you got the steel part here and you got the other type of carving here but it's in in the wood type and i also have a this one it's a spice kitchen container but it's like a container for the sauces so it's just a really convenient way to just pack some of the sauces and next are these ones um i have balloons here and i think this is less than three dollars maybe i'm not sure but it was marked sale as well from Kmart, and i bought this color flame candles and as well as the happy birthday one so i got this for six dollars as well and a metallic card stock cardboard i'm gonna print something here i'm gonna use this one for um a cake topper or a cupcake topper and yeah that's it <laughs> quite a lot huh and with all the purchase that i have i'm actually happy with it and i cannot wait to use all of it all of it guys so um yeah i just wanted to thank everyone who supported our channel thank you so much please don't forget to like and also subscribe and click the notification bell so that you will be updated with our upcoming videos or new videos thank you thank you everyone and have a great day